guys welcome back to the channel this is sam's budgeting corner it's another game day and i'm excited to see who will be getting most of this money so i do hope that you're all doing well i'm doing fine weather is good it's a little bit windy outside i'm doing this recording on tuesday night so um you'll see this video on wednesday morning so guys today i'm working with 25 dollars for game day stuffing and as usual we will start with our roll and strike which is available on my etsy shop so before we get to that let's count the cash so we're working with 5 10 15 20 25 we'll put this to the side and then we'll get our roll and strike out okay guys so this is our roll and strike we are doing this one today right here so let's roll and see how this one will pan out okay so four so that one is off two okay let's see if we get another big number <laughs> oh no okay it's what it is so we have to color this in all right guys what this means we are supposed to be saving six and five eleven and one twelve and three fifteen dollars so fifteen dollars is gonna go towards roll and strike so let's count it out so five ten fifteen right so what i'm going to do at the end i'm going to um when i'm doing spin the wheel i'll share this $15 for three persons. So I'll roll three times at the end and then split this $15. So each person will get five each. All right, so that is it for roll and strike. So what that means is that we have $10 left. We are going to use prop money to do spin the wheel. So let's count the 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. So we have that for spin the wheel so let's get into it guys so this is our binder so not a lot of money for spin the wheel but we're gonna make it work so we're gonna be doing 10 spins because we have ten dollars so let's get started okay so first up is Jade. She's getting one dollar. So Jade is starting us off. Let's see who will be second. Okay, second is J1, which is good because I don't think he got any the last time. Third is Hubby. So we're doing good because at least everybody's getting one so far let's see who would be the fourth person that would be grandpa so let's see number five is going to be hubby so hubby gets another dollar okay so let's spin again So now it's Jan that gets one. That's the first one for Jan. Let's see who will get the next one. That will be Hubby. Seems like Hubby's getting a lot this week. So one more to Hubby. So guys, we have three more um, notes left. So let's see who will be getting these three. So that's Jan, that's getting another dollar. So Jan gets one more. Let's see who will get the next two. That would be J2, which is good. So J2 gets one more, gets one, 
two persons have not received anything yet and that is grandma and Sam so let's see who will get this last dollar that's awesome the last dollar goes to grandma so grandma gets a dollar okay all right so that's awesome all right guys so remember we so remember we have 15 dollars from roll and strike so we're going to roll three times to see who will be getting um five dollars each so let's see so j2 gets five J2 gets 5. Let's see who will get the other 5. Oh, Hubby gets the other 5. I also, Sam has not gotten any as yet. So let's see. We have, so we add this 5 to Hubby. We have one more 5 to go. So let's see if Sam can get this one. So Sam didn't get anything, but Grandma gets this five. I think the last um, game stuffing, Grandma didn't get anything at all. So we're adding five to Grandma. All right, so that is everything for spin the wheel. So what I'm going to be doing now, guys, I'm going to be counting to see what's in each envelope. Any any prop money that's five dollars or more, then I'll just change it out for the real five dollar. So we're gonna start with J1. Before I start doing this, just so you know, so um, hubby got the most money this week. He got eight dollars. So that's. Um, just letting you know so now let's count what's in these envelopes right now so this is 10 12 13 so we don't need to add we don't need to change anything for j1 moving to j2 let's see how much j2 has so j2 has 10 15 20 21 don't need to change anything there Let's go to Jan. So Jan has 20, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45. So we'll switch this out, guys. So we're adding 5. So Jan has 45. Then we move over to Jade to count how much Jade has. Jade has 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. We can change this out. We add 5. So that makes it 30 for Jade. Moving along quite nicely. We'll go to Grandma. Grandma got $6 this week. So that brings her to a total of 10, 15, 20. 21 22 so that's okay um grandpa got a dollar this week and that brings grandpa to 10 15 20 21 22 dollars so doing good next is sam sam didn't get anything this week i was out of luck next is the last envelope is hubby hubby got eight dollars so let's count the total so Abby now has okay, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So we'll change out five of this prop money for five dollars. So five. So here's a 10, 15, 20, 25, 26. So hubby got is at $26. So as you all can tell, um, even though Obi got the most money this week, um, still in the lead is Jan with $45. So Jan is still leading the pack um, with $45.
so that brings us guys to the end of my family game day stuff and it was fun it was excited it went fast because most of the money went to roll and spin but that's okay so guys i really appreciate you joining joining me today my next video will be coming out on monday and that's where i'll be cash stuffing our second paycheck for the month of june we'll be cash stuffing our sinking funds um thank you guys so much for watching i truly appreciate you all if you haven't yet subscribed please go ahead and do so and remember to click that notification bell so have yourself a wonderful day and i will see you on monday bye